What's up guys, we finally made it to the dirt road. We've been driving since just after four this morning. Um, <coughs> it's our annual Ochibamba hunt. This year we brought the girls with, so Sereska joining. Marku, Jordan brought Petrus, his girlfriend. Um, Paul brought Inay. Yevan brought himself and Richelle came with. Um, but yeah, I lost the plot there. Anyway, uh, we're very excited. Um, are they already sitting in the heights? We're about 30 kilometers out, or just above 30 kilometers out. Super excited, just had to quickly stop and stretch the legs again. And uh, can't wait. I hope you guys enjoy the video. We get trying to get her on an Impala. You must pad over there now. And uh, then Marku van der Bank behind the camera also wants to get an Impala, both with the crossbow. I'm also on the menu for an Impala. I've not shot anything with the bow so far this year, so we'll see what happens. But yeah, let's get cracking again, and uh, I'll see you guys when we get to the lodge. Guys, so we made it to the lodge. There's the other people. We are waiting for Marku and Devan and not that Marku, other Marku and Paul. They're busy hunting. I think Marku, Marku got an animal. Once again, not this one. He's with us. But uh, Marku got an animal, so good first one off the board. Anyway, we're just gonna get ourselves situated, get our bows shot in. They are both shooting with the crossbows. Richelle, what are you gonna do? She's Sleep. probably... Said where? Sleep. There we go. Out of the month of the Seicheling. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but anyway, we're going to get ourselves situated, shoot our bows in, and hopefully we're going to do the afternoon session like at 1 o'clock. It's now like somewhere between 11 and 12. And uh, then uh, we'll see you guys, hopefully, either in a hide or on a bucky or somewhere where we're doing something. Stay tuned. Squirt up. Center punched. Wow. Morse do it. Yes, yeah, look fine. This rag op your onderkant van die klein circles. Okay guys, we in the blind. It's half past one. So that's guys half ten in the parlor, but we forgot the uh, shooting sticks. So she's gonna shoot from my camera tripod. <laughs> so if the video Morning guys, so um, yesterday was unsuccessful. I've got some dust on my screen. There you go. Yesterday was unsuccessful and um, today is uh, day two, because day two comes after day one. And um, is, does it make my double chin go away? Yeah, and your Mexican beard look a bit better. All right, great. 
Um, the bike is on its way. We're gonna go out for day two. Hopefully, Suresh get something. Diamon wants to get something. Marco wants to get something. Um, so hopefully it all goes well. Stay tuned. We're gonna finish our coffee and then go out into the field. How's it, guys? We just got in the hide. Let's do this, guys. Are you ready to shoot an Impala? And uh, there's the. We, we remember the shooting stick today. There's the crossbow. My bow is ready for if water comes in. And uh, there's the shooting holes. <laughs> Hand op, hand op, hand op. Hand op, hand op. Weet je, ik denk dat mijn zetter geschiet. There's a lot of blood here. A lot of blood. Face. He's a stick from the liver. The liver is like here. There's the blood. Look. I think it's a deflect and I'm going to die. Yeah. It's a liver. It's a liver. Yeah, Tom. She hit him perfectly. So I'm not too worried. But we just don't know where the arrow is. We only got pain. Um, guts. Yet pains definitive. Deep like more either. Okay guys, so 
we back in the hide. We're waiting for Umtina. So we quickly went out to go fetch the arrow. And um, she hit him perfectly like how I told her to hit it. And you could see it was there was just absolutely pumping blood everywhere. Um, but it does seem like she hit a bit of um, stomach of the of the cut. And um, we, because of that, I don't want to go ruin the whole blood trail. So we got the arrow and we saw a lot of blood. We, we made careful not to walk over anything, everything. And um, so we're bringing the dogs in. We're going to give it 20 minutes to half an hour. We've already given it about 20 minutes. Um, and then we're going to go because I'm pretty sure the dog, the animal is dead. I just want to be extra sure. But anyway, we'll uh, check in with you guys once um, Tina's gets here. She's a, a stressed wreck at the moment. And um, yeah, but it was, it's a giant impala. Like it had, I, I don't know if it was just a video, but it had twin towers on it. Like, oof. so um, we'll see. Stay tuned. So I swear, I soon do. I soon do. Het is een mooie ram. Dit is die mooiste van die drie geweest wat daar gaat. Er drie rammen in. Drie rammen in gekom. Eén met beetje flaring tips. Waterkant uit eigen haarklip. Hij is zoen toe. Die kant uit. Ja. Dit heeft beetje flaring tips. Nee, maar hij was... Eén bij met flaring. Hij is weier as die ander hier gaan nu. Ek denk as die bloed nie. Het is die bloed aan nie. Anyway, hij is weier as die ander lot geweest. Baie weier geweest. Pes, kom. Ek is so vast. Hoor jy maar, toe sy na dit na sy die skoot geskiet het, toe sy in trane van die adrenalien. Daal jy, wees. Daal jy. Ek wil gesê, hy is dood. Wel, ek wil gesê, ek sê so lang. Daal sy, wees. Mooi, wees hier. Here we go. We found Wes's animal. Ja, hy het slight court ring towards. Maar hy het a... Sy het die grootste ram geskiet uit van die lot. Hierdie ram is baie soos hy een wat ek laas jaar geskiet het. Dit is een baie mooie ram. Dit is gepraat in die ram. Jy moet nie in die pad af. Maar kyk, kyk, wat sy het om hier ingeskiet aan die ander kant. Maar hy was so, van haar was hy slight quartering towards. Hy sal het so 23 sekunde. Nou kan ek kou. Mooi, sy wel dan in jou drukkie. Dit is een ram. Okay guys, so we've made it to the end of uh, Vian's video. Um, this is the end of the trip, everyone's packing up. There's a Devon packing up. There's the Marku packing up. Everyone's just packing up everything. It was a good trip. Um, I unfortunately, I think it's in the video, I'm not sure. <laughs> Shot miss. Um, so with the back tension, I released the safety too early. And uh, yeah, the shot went off very prematurely and I ended up shooting that like shooting the cement little wall behind the impala and she was like at 13 yards so it's pretty embarrassing but it happens and it definitely goes to show sorry there's something on my screen definitely goes to show my shot process is wrong and I definitely have to improve that um two weeks before my next hunting trip so I definitely have to improve that and then please like and subscribe this is okay cool <laughs> There you have it. Like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Um, this is still VG Outdoors, so oh. thank you, Paul. <laughs> uh, I'm going to make the Trigger Punch Bandits out yeah, for now. Now well. there's going to be a few more views because there was actually a decent personality in the video. Hectic. <laughs> Alright, I hope you guys enjoyed the video and uh, I hope you guys enjoyed seeing Suriska shoot a giant ram and the emotion she went through. Like and subscribe, as Paul said. We'll see you guys on the next one. Bye!